How's it going everyone? I'm Ben, back with another video. I brought you some interesting tech news. The first one is interesting because it's gonna impact the future of humanity in a huge way, and that is SpaceX. And SpaceX just landed the first Starship rocket in one piece. There were two previous attempts for this. Both of them blew up on landing, but this one succeeded. Kind of. It actually blew up as well after landing. And the the landing was not... Wow, yeah. It was a huge uh, explosion after the landing. So I hope no one was hurt there. But this is a great attempt. Again, that an, another step that would take us to Mars. That is the goal. We want to go to Mars. We want to go to the moon first. And these are going to be the ships that are going to help us get there. Um, SpaceX also has um, this pretty awesome Wikipedia page I have seen. Uh, I've just uh, checked this out. Um, this is SpaceX Starship. And they list you the, the attempts here and how this whole project will come together. And I mean, just look at this, guys. It's just a beautiful ship. Like that's that's honestly something coming out of Star Wars, like you know the Nubian um, Naboo starship. It's just beautiful. It is fully chrome. I mean, yeah, it, it really stands out from the rest of rockets. Uh, I'm so excited for the space era. Wow. It's going to be huge. But coming back to space, uh, space, yes, coming back to Earth here, we've got a nice Porsche bike that's cost between eight grand and 10 grand. So it still has a nice price. Uh, obviously, it's from Porsche. They unveiled the Taycan. The Taycan, am I saying right? Yeah, the Taycan. This is their electric offering, and they also brought some bikes with it, which is pretty neat. You know, if you cru cruise around with this one, you would stand out for sure. Um, you know, the mountains wouldn't be an issue for you. Um, this is this is actually interesting because uh, they're gonna test the technology with bikes as well. Um, I'm excited to see more sexy looking bikes like this that are electric bikes i've seen some but those were like you know some boxes attached to them and they were kind of janky so yeah i'm i, I want to see much more of them and would definitely love to see a lower price and more affordable price for such a sexy beast okay um and then we've got something interesting here this is a futuristic lab grown steak it has only one issue and that is it is not edible um this this is this is uh, an attempt to to really reduce um the the amount of meat we eat and uh hopefully you know it's going to be something that astronauts can take with them to to different planets like Mars and the moon. Moon is moon is a moon. Uh, but yeah, uh, you get the point. So um, we've got lab grown meat here, and um, you see how 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 it was constructed. Um, it's quite a technical language. Um, if you are a nano uh, technologist. But um, yeah, it's it's definitely an interesting read. I have a browse through. What I wanted to show here is how the meat, the, the this lab grown meat looks before heating, and after heating, it's I don't know. It's still like not looking good. Where this this is this is the real deal. This is the real deal here. This is the real meat, and then you see some. Oh, I don't know. So after some heating, some barbecuing, you know, it, it's it's looking better than than this thing. Um, I wouldn't be, you know, necessarily eating that as of yet. They will definitely find a way how we can eventually consume these kind of things. But like the, these were um, constructed from 
artificial materials like hydrogels. Um, I'm not too sure if I want to put stuff like this into my body. Um, let me know otherwise. I'm, I'm really curious. This was the video for today. Let me know what you think. What are your top picks from these articles? I'm going to link them down in the description. And uh, yeah, like wh wh what's the one you're you're getting most inspired and excited about? That would be interesting to know. To know. Um, let's start a conversation. Uh, with that being said, thank you so much for watching. And until next time, guys. Thanks a lot. See you.